you'll be perfectly behaved when we do my TV show in one hour. <sighs> that was awful. In fact, it was worse than awful. It would have to get better just to be awful. Hi, Garfield. Hi, Kittykins. Hey, how do you know my name, Kittykins? Wait. You're Harry, that cat from my neighborhood. <laughs> That's me. Well, what are you doing pretending to be a tame cat named Kittykins? You're as bad as I am. I got me a job. I pretend to be a successful result of Doc Whipple's training, and every day he pays me my weight in tuna fish. He can afford that? Are you kidding? You know how much this guy makes off these stupid lessons he sells? How much does he make? Enough to pay you your weight in tuna. Well, that's a lot of tuna. Yeah, play along. Help him sell the stuff, and you could have the same great job I have. Hmm. Which would I rather have? My weight in tuna every day? For my integrity. Ooh, these moral decisions are hard. Oh no, the world's foremost trainer of Robo Pops, Dr. Wimble! Today you will see the results of my greatest challenge. Worst behaved cat I'd ever seen. Garfield. I put him through my extreme housebreaking program, and now you will see the results. <laughs> Garfield? Garfield? Do you have any desire to mistreat small puppies? Do you have any desire to steal food or shred drapes? <laughs> that cat has become so well behaved. We have to order Dr. Whipple's DVDs, tapes, and books. But we don't have a cat. Oh, very good, Garfield. Now, is there anything you'd like to do? Yes.